My name's Hannah Rooney. I'm a service designer at Context Studio and we've been really lucky to get funding from the Creative Ireland Spark Creative Climate Action Fund to run a big project on helping move sustainable energy communities from plan to do. We've gotten a group of renters here tonight to try and help them come up with tips and advice on how they could decarbonise in the community. The climate chats and chips idea was so that we could really encourage people to come in a really open way, it wasn't going to be too structured and we just kind of help people get to know each other, feel comfortable coming on their own if they wanted to, to kind of loosen that conversation up and so that they'd go home hopefully with a few new friends, a bit of a sense of community and with their bellies full of chips. I actually learned a lot of practical tips but also one of the main things is just learning that um, People are like really interested in working together to find solutions and that there's a lot of energy for that. It made me feel actually like, like hopeful. It's definitely made me feel like I'm not alone in the community of um, renters um, and definitely feel a little bit more empowered um, going forward and like I have some, I have some actions that I'm going to take. It made me feel welcome and heard and it's, it's nice to be part of a project where things can be fruitful and help everybody else, not just oneself. I felt like there are things that we can do as a community, we can get together and we can learn from each other and that felt really nice. The session tonight made me feel a bit empowered to try and get more involved in the community. One thing I learned tonight was a lot of tips about how to keep your house warm and just things that you can do every day, really easy things like opening your windows every morning, turning on your heat in a sort of strategic way to stop mold growing. People doing their own um, double glazing of their windows, so getting magnetic tape and putting a layer of perspex on the outside of the window. Uh, I learned about putting foil behind your radiator to uh, reflect the heat into the room. Someone told me that if you put a tea light under a ceramic pot and prop that up on bricks, that created like a heat source that's apparently quite powerful. I thought that was amazing. Collaboration is key and sharing of ideas and co-design workshops are always great to do and one can learn so much from just a conversation. The fact that there was such an amount of tips and tricks and advice shared amongst everybody over just this short space of an hour or two means that all of that advice can now be scaled and hopefully people will not only feel like they can make changes to their own home but also that they can now share all that great advice with their community and maybe join in on things to help. We're looking forward to putting it all into action over the next few weeks and we're going to design some prototypes that are going to go out in the community.